Hey internet, this is Michael, back with another video. I know I haven't recorded in a while, well I've recorded in a while, uh, in the last little while, I just haven't been able to upload stuff because of camera issues, which I have been trying to fix, and I figured it out very recently, like literally last night, I was like, oh my gosh, this is what it is, and it was the fact that iMovie can't import MP4s and use them properly sometimes, so that was it, that was literally it, I, I have an action camera part of my setup, it's called the Yi something something uh it's a, it's by a company called xiaomi and this action camera i use for the footage that you're seeing right here uh and i take that and i put it into the computer and i add audio from this microphone called the task cam whatever uh it's just a cheap audio and video setup it costs like i don't even know like 200 bucks and it has everything and i think it sounds and looks pretty nice and i've been fixing this kind of setup for a little bit now and eventually, later in the week, I will actually get to a lot of depth on how I make these videos. But for right now, this is the gist of it, okay? We cool? We cool. Okay, so I figured out how to fix the MP4 issue with uh, iMovie last night. And that was basically take those MP4s and just convert them to MOV files, which is something I guess QuickTime can read and iMovie stuff can read. And it works perfectly. I mean, like, look at this video. It's all in stunning HD. Yeah, so it works. Uh, that's what I did last night. The other four nights were kind of a blur. Uh, something I remember doing was just a lot of Sharpie art. I'm not getting high. Like, let me be clear. Uh, I do not do Sharpie art for the intended side effects. Some weirdos do it, like, to get high. I just, I literally just like the look of Sharpies. It looks so cool to me. Uh, I will upload better pictures of this. It will probably be over me making the book unravel stuff but like yeah i have been actually working and doing cool stuff uh in fact a failed art project coming at like sunday of next week will be will be one of the things i have been working on recently but aside from all of that what's been happening with me my dog susie who was pregnant had puppies which are here now and i have pictures I hope you see them on the screen. I hope they look as adorable to you as they do to me. They're just little tiny itty bitty dogs. They're adorable. Sorry, I had to, I had to show you because like they're just adorable. I don't want to be one of those people who like show everyone their dogs and they're like they're amazing, right? And I'm like kind of becoming that guy. And I regret nothing because they're adorable. Basically, that's what I've been doing. I had to help my parents deliver the puppies uh yeah that was that was uh gosh what was it saturday it was the 29th yeah so it was one of those days right so i i did i went through my entire day right and i stayed up and then at 2 a.m when i was getting ready to go to bed my dog started panting and doing some weird stuff so i came to get my dad and by the time he got back in the room she was having her puppy I was like, I'm out. I gotta go to bed and stuff. Uh, so he delivered like three dogs. I woke up a couple hours later because I couldn't sleep. I was kind of worried about my dog, making sure she's okay. And anyway, she was. She was perfectly fine. She had five puppies, which was cool. But by that time, she had like three. And by the time she was having more, I was sent out to the store to get some puppy milk in Tracy. And I live in Manteca. So it was a little bit. Of ways I had to go to get the actual puppy milk which is fine I have, I have no problem whatsoever doing whatever I need to do to keep my dog healthy and keep her puppies healthy you know cuz I'm just that nice of a guy and that's 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 not even being a nice guy actually that's just being a decent person that like wants to take care of their nice things like having a happy healthy puppy with other puppies that are smaller because they were literally born yesterday so that was that was that was the 29th in a nutshell uh, the day before that actually was this really cool art class, which I will, I will show you some cool stuff that we did in there. Uh, it's not a, my notebook fell that I just showed you my cool art from. So one of the things, uh, that art class wanted me to do was draw a picture of Mary because this is an art history class, right? Mary's a very prominent history icon because iconography is a thing because it's a definition we had to learn. Because there was a midterm that came by, which I passed with like a solid B. Like I didn't even know one of the images, which 
Okay, let me get in a little bit into the depth of what this test actually entailed. Basically, I had to see these images. I had to write as much as I could about them, make an intelligent thought, make a, some sort of an observation for like 20 images. I mean, it wasn't hard, but I had to like read a lot of stuff prior to this and like remember it and put some stuff down. I didn't even know what one of these images was. Anyway, that was the midterm that I passed with flying colors. I mean, I got a B and I didn't even study once in that class, which is pretty cool. Michael Stevens, really cool guy awesome teacher i'm not saying this class is easy like by by no means is it easy at all all i'm saying is i'm really good at making tests happen in my favor but anyway one of the things that we had to do in this same class uh was, was draw mary right so you had to have a few details you had to have her be like age 12 to 13 very young person because in the bible they were younger people because they didn't live as long uh this is wasn't even about the bible though it was just about the character mary in the annunciation i believe it was Basically, when Mary was told, you are carrying the Son of God. Have a nice day. <laughs> so, uh, one of the things that we had to do was make her 12, make her wearing blue, make her golden hair, which I didn't even know she had golden hair. Apparently, she does. Uh, she had to have, like, 12 stars around her head, right? Just all these really specific things. And I think I did a craptastic job because I did this in pens literally just in pens uh yeah let me show you that for a bit there's a crown which i had to include her dress and stuff oh yeah and the dragon by the way that's a moon right she had to have a moon beneath her feet and the dragon underneath her that she had slayed what i didn't even know that was part of the thing uh, but yeah apparently a lot of people didn't know this but like and the whole, like, these are the instructions from this guy. He was some famous artist. He was giving instructions on how to paint it correctly, uh, this event. Yeah, there's just all of these things that you need to have. And it's like, light represents God. The light coming from her forehead is supposed to represent the baby. She's now getting knowledge that she's carrying. Just all these different things. How she's just so stoic and stuff. And that image was, let's be honest, that was pretty crap. Better than a preschooler, but, like, worse than anyone who even remotely should be getting an art major. Which I'm going to be doing. I'm getting an AA. In the process of it, anyway. And then when I got home at, like, 2 a.m., I started on this. And then my dog ended up having puppies, so I ended up having to put it down. Not the, not the dog, just this, just the paper and stuff. Because I was working on some stuff. And over the next couple days, like, that, after I caught up on some sleep, which is another reason why I couldn't make the videos, uh... Because my eyes were just so baggy and stuff. I ended up making a really cool logo. It's called... My show logo. Recording in progress. <laughs> I, it was inspired... This part... Okay, this part is actually inspired by Girl Boss. Then this part is, like, inspired by Tomska's... I think it's, like, Sugar or something. It's a font that he uses in his show. Literally, one of his... I think the, the story goes, like, one of his people just like start with their own handwriting just started scribbling out words and like erasing it and made cool made a cool font which i thought was really awesome because that guy makes cool vlogs and stuff yes yeah, so lots of stuff has just been happening and i've been trying to record vlogs uh but the camera wasn't working and i just fixed it so yeah there's no excuse at this point in time i have to be making videos because i have no excuses I'm a procrastinator, a chronic procrastinator. My teachers in high school would just, they, they would know. Like, they're a prime source to tell you that I straight up don't do homework. Uh, but this, I just really am passionate about. I've been trying to get this to work, and I have bought an audio equipment specifically for this. That AT2035 that I ordered from, like, eBay. It was really cool. It was, like, 80 bucks for this $150 microphone. Like, that's how expensive it was. Got it for 80 bucks and shipping and stuff, and it's coming from Arizona. It should be here Wednesday, and I am kicking off Tech Week tomorrow to talk about all the cool audio stuff and all the cool equipment that I'll be using in my videos. It's going to be really cool. You should subscribe if you want to see that kind of stuff, because if not, I have no idea how you're going to see like these videos. Like the, the video like titles are just so weird. I swear to God, they're just weird. 